Hello and welcome back to another ICS prayer video. It's been a little while but we've been very busy with our 200th anniversary celebrations which took place at the end of June in London so thank you so much to everybody who attended as we got to celebrate 200 years of ICS. We're currently looking forward to our Northern Ireland event which will take place later this year so keep an eye out for more information about that and please pray for us in our preparations for that event as well. I'm now going to take you slightly back in time to the end of April to our chaplains conference um, which took place in Switzerland and some of the chaplains are just going to speak directly to you to share some things that you can be praying for for them and then I will be back with some other prayer points. My name's Ruin Crew. I'm the chaplain at Holy Trinity Utrecht, together with congregations in Zwolle and Groningen, that's in the Netherlands. And I've been there since August last summer, having moved across from St. James Voorschoten. Utrecht is a, quite a large chaplaincy with a lot going on, and uh, we're very excited to be there. And we feel that the pandemic is behind us now, and there's a lot of excitement about where we're going next, and how God is bringing new people to us, and encouraging us and building us up. So we're very excited about what the coming years have to offer. My connection with ICS goes back many years because, of course, having been chaplain at St. James Voorschoten as well as in, in Utrecht, I've had that link now for many, many years. What I really appreciate is alongside the diocesan connection, this, this network of chaplains from a similar background coming together for conferences like this and having the opportunity to just enjoy fellowship and to support each other and to, to know that togetherness in ministry is really very, very good. Hi everyone, I am Matt and I am now the assistant curate at St. James in Voorschoten, which is in the Netherlands, uh, near the coast between The Hague and Leiden. Uh, and we are here in sunny Switzerland with the beautiful mountains behind us. Um, I'd like to tell you a bit about St. James. We're currently in an interregnum um, as our uh, chaplain Ruin left in the last year. And so we are uh, looking for a new chaplain, which is very exciting. And that means that I am sort of left in charge for the moment, uh, which is wonderful and uh, we have been doing some exciting things this past year. We've just had a church weekend, which is lovely. We uh, have uh, lots of new people who are coming into the church who are uh, linked to the university. So we've got some international students uh, and some other people. And shall I, let me also tell you something about ICS, okay? And uh, we are, think very fondly of ICS. We love ICS so much. Uh, one of the reasons is, of course, with our interregnum, with our vacancy currently, uh, Richard and the team are helping us to find a, a new chaplain, which is a real support. And we also love the fact that through ICS, we are connected with other chaplaincies in Europe and further abroad, which is wonderful. So we can be praying for one another. We can hand in our own prayer requests and, and have you guys pray for us. So thank you so much for doing that. And please continue to pray for us that God will lead us into uh, the future that he has for us. Thank you. So since the recording of that video, Matt Tice has actually been appointed as chaplain of St. James for Shooting, so he will be continuing his ministry there and he will be licensed next month. So please pray for him and his family as they take on this new responsibility and continue to see that church grow and flourish. Please also pray for the interviews taking place in Versailles on the 10th of September, that the right candidates can come forward and that those interviews can be a really fruitful time for everybody. Jack, who manages our properties, will be travelling around the Paris area at the start of next month as well to visit the different churches and to um, have some meetings. So please pray that those are really productive meetings and that a lot can be come out of those. Richard will also be travelling around the same time where he will be hoping to develop some new work with some of the chaplaincies. Thank you so much for praying with us. We have a Zoom prayer meeting coming up next month that we should also love to see you at. Um, in the meantime, make sure you are following our social media where you can see all of the latest updates which are going on in the world of ICS. Thank you so much and we will see you again soon.